On Monday, Selena Gomez sent a brief message of body positivity to her Instagram. The actress 31 shared a picture of herself in a tiny zebra bikini from the past, along with a more recent bathing suit photo, in which she showed off her larger body in white tube top and high waisted bikini bottoms. Today, I realize I will never look like this again, Selena wrote over the first picture which was taken in Miami, Florida in 2013. Selena had previously admitted to sobbing my eyes out over body shaming remarks. In the next photo, which was taken in Mexico in 2023, she commented, I'm not perfect, but I am proud to be who I am sometimes I forget it's okay to be me. Selena has previously expressed messages of body positivity on several occasions, she also attacked body shamers in February of last year, admitting that her weight increase was caused by her lupus medicine. Earlier in the day, Gomez visited the skincare clinic Face Place in West Hollywood without makeup and wore gray cashmere-style sweatshirts and beige fuzzy slides. The 52-year-old institution, which provides medical aesthetic procedures like Cabela, Botox, radiofrequency microneedling, and plasma fibroblast skin tightening, was welcomed by the pop diva with her hands full. Gomez responded to online trolls who made disparaging remarks about her figure in February of last year by declaring that she would never be a model. The actress from Only Murders in the Building revealed that she will hold a lot of water weight as a result of the numerous drugs she takes and urged her followers to love themselves even when they feel ashamed. The Lose You to Love Me singer has already spoken up about her experience with mental health issues and her diagnosis of autoimmune illness, added, I tend to kind of lose weight when I'm off of it. The former Disney star stated that the insignificant side effect is insignificant compared to her health, even though she is still celebrating body positivity. I think my medications are what help me and they are important. She advised the critics to get over it, saying, to be honest, I don't think it's right to shame people for their body or anything. Well, no, I'm not a model, she stated, and I never will be. And I think they're awesome mind you I just, I'm definitely not that, she continued. The hitmaker then kept urging her followers to embrace and cherish who they are. I wanted to encourage and support anyone who is experiencing shame for what they are going through, since nobody is aware of the full story, she stated. I just want everyone to know how amazing and gorgeous you are. The former cast member of Wizards of Waverly Place emphasized the value of her health over appearances as well. She admitted, and sure, there are days when we might feel like us, but I would much rather be healthy and take care of myself. The founder of Rare Beauty blocked more body-shaming remarks she had gotten the month before, after attending the 2023 Golden Globes. I'm a little bit huge right now, because I enjoyed myself during the holidays, ha. Huh. Selena questioned her nine-year-old half-sister Gracie during an Instagram live. I think Gracie agrees, Selena said, but we don't care. In a video posted to her TikTok stories in 2022, she also called out body shamers. To be honest, I don't give a damn about my weight since, well, people bh about it, that doesn't fit, you're too big or too small, meh 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 meh. I am flawless just the way I am, bh, the story's lesson? Goodbye, she said. But in an episode of the Apple TV Plus documentary series last year, the celebrity said that body shamers had a greater negative influence on her than she had first admitted. Kindly. Going viral, Gomez claimed to be bawling my eyes out while giving the impression that she didn't care about the backlash. I told a lie. When I posted a picture of myself online, I would add, it doesn't matter. I reject what you're stating, she uttered. I'm in the room posting and crying my eyes out because no one should have to hear those things, the speaker said. In September 2017, the vocalist of the song Lose You to Love Me revealed that she had received a kidney transplant. Gomez, who had suffered organ damage from her lupus diagnosis at the age of 24, needed a kidney transplant. So, her friend Francia Reza decided to give her kidney to save her life.